Hey guys, GADB Gaming here, and welcome back to a brand new Survive the Hunt on my channel. We are getting going very soon at half past seven, and that is when we can look to get into the city and change my style and my car and, and everything. And there's the array of hunters who are going to be chasing me down. And so let's get in my car. Let's give it a reverse into Mark's car. Knock him off. Nope, didn't work. Okay, let's hope. Hopefully. Oh, okay. Okay, it actually really didn't work. I was hoping I could then get a jack afterwards. There we go. We're through! You know, I always go that way, so we're going to go different. We're going to go up here. Right, so. We've added a little bit of a change. My god, this guy just wants to oversteer the entire time. So, we've added a little bit of an extra objective for me to do within my two hour head start period. No longer is it just going in city, changing my car, changing my style. Oh my god. Uh, this is some terrible handling. Changing my car, changing my style, you know, and then despawning my vehicle. I now have to hide my vehicle because if the hunters in the, ch in the hunt find my car and blow it up, which they quite like to do normally, I, as a result now, have to initiate a chase with the hunters. What does that entail? It means I have to do some rather stupid driving and you've gone right on a left lane. Um, or maybe have them surviving. I don't know. Something to get the attention of the hunters. And the way it will classify is particularly if the hunter doesn't know that I'm there, I have to crash into a hunter. And then once I've crashed into it, that is how we know that it has started. So, my current objective is actually finding a spot to hide it so i'm feeling like i'm not going to just go try hardy and tuck it away in some nook and cranny that they're never going to find let's see if they can find it so what i'm going to do instead is i'm going to park my car up here i mean there should be no reason for them to go up this high oh intercept accidentally left he should be back soon right there should be no reason for them to go up this high but I think if the chopper has his eye, keen eye on him, he will easily spot like that's not not tucked away. It's obvious. It's a dew yellow as well, so it should stand out. I didn't do a uh, any uh, underglow because I thought like that would be a little bit too much of an overkill. So let's see how this plays. If they find it, well played to them. If they don't, then you know it's just unlucky. So that is my first one done. So what's my second objective? I think it's time to find a car, and I think I'm actually going to start off with this fusillade right here and a brown one at it as well. There's a lot of sports cars spawning around here, so let's utilise the fact that I'm allowed a sports car and the hunters aren't, and let's grab one. And I haven't really, I don't really explore fusillades either, so it's nice. So that's number two, and lastly my style and we're going to because I've had a change of style and hair and everything I've had a good reset with one of these this is what we're looking like today we're in a beanie we've got a shirt 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 no we're gonna get it right a sleeveless shirt my god kept getting muddled up and uh, yeah we're good to go so I got going at 19.30 and so two hours means we've got less than half now until the hunters are released so I'm gonna slowly make my way over to the hunters to see if we can get any of them to pass me as they leave. Because why not? Who doesn't like to say hello? There's an actual F X F620 there. I do like it. No, just stick with the fuselade. You said yourself earlier, you haven't been them. Yes. Right. Anyway, speaking of cars, let's show you the map quickly of the objectives I have today. So we've got 10 delicious cars on offer today. And here they are dotted around the map. We don't actually, for a first, have anything that's directly up top. The hunters have decided to go for a few different placements. And, uh, yeah, this is what we have for today. So it's going to be interesting. Some new ones. So some of the standout oh, contenders whilst I'm trying to grab my pad <laughs> and break at the same time. So we have, uh, where is it? Uh, parking garage next to Mission Road Police Station. Haven't done that one before, so that's new. The Morningwood Ron's Garage Way in, the, in Ron's Garage in an alleyway. That's new. And then... I don't have number 10 on me. Where is Jack? Oh, Jax is, is in Strawberry near the, um, what do you call it? Uh, what do you call it? Uh, the strip club. Thank you. So, it's, but it's not right by, I, 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 can, I know where it is on the map. I've got the image in my head, so I know roughly where I'm going for it. Well, the hunters would have been released now. I haven't seen any of them, so I'm assuming we are in the clear then. So, we can start thinking about which cars we're going to go for. And move it on from there really so i'm 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 excited for this one so in terms of hunts wise i haven't 
done a hunt in quite some time. I'm trying to think the last time we did it. Basically, we got to the summer months and everyone was starting to be busy. And we, we couldn't get the designated double figures of at least 10 that I, I set myself now in order to do a hunt. Actually, it's red light. I'm just going to go right. So I held off for a long, long, long time doing one of these. So I haven't done one in ages. So even though I'm going to be rusty in hunting and hunting and surviving hunts, like I saw a second ago, I hit the reverse lights. I've been still doing GTN. And meanwhile, jumping on with the guys, doing whatever, doing some other games, uh, like tag and hunt the survivors and stuff like that. So I'm not going to be like completely rusty from GTA in terms of like that. But in terms of surviving, it could be a bit squiffy. But we'll see how it goes. But whilst I am also remembering about the objectives, we've got so. That was the first rule, with the, um, not the first rule, the first tweak we've done for this one with my car. You've got to make sure it's in a good spot. Although actually I have just turned off phone alerts, so I'm just wondering whether or not I'm going to get buzzed about that. Okay, what we'll do is I'm going to quickly just run through my text, get rid of any of those alerts. And then if I hear a noise and I can remember to check my phone... It should then be Moore's Mutual saying, oh yeah, oh, okay, there is a hunter. Cool, there we go, my phone's all clear. You know when you go on your phone in real life, whatever, and you have those few uh, emails coming through and you've got to go through and just click on them or delete them or whatever, just so you get rid of the notifications, because otherwise, if you leave it for too long, you'll have over a thousand emails not read, and you don't know what to do. <coughs> How's this suddenly got onto me? Right, okay, let's change topic. <laughs> What's that left turn go to actually? It's just like a designated left turn into that car park. It must be anyway. So, uh, where was I? Okay, yeah. So that was the other thing. I should get a notification, and then that's when I need to initiate chase. The other one about the objectives as well. Oh, I accidentally hit the circle too many times. Is I have to get six out of the ten cars today. So another little rule that I've implemented actually, rather than discussing with the hunters, the hunters did the car one. This is one that I put in for myself actually just to make it a little bit different is I can keep getting 5 out of 10 cars each time like I've gotten to the point where I think for the last few I've managed to get 5 out of 10 there's been the odd one or two where I haven't and it's then forced to a car park escape but it wasn't quite as entertaining or as chaotic as I was hoping for so I've tweaked it now every time I survive a hunt and I start a winning streak the next successive hunt I then have to I'm just going to keep AIs would do these dodgy sort of movements, so it's fine. I'm then gonna increase the number of cards I have to get, and then, like I said, in the success of one by plus one each time. So I survived the previous hunt to this. Spoilers in case you haven't watched it. Um, so I now have six to get in this one, and it will keep going until I have to max it out at ten. But at that point, it'll be a bloody miracle if I can get ten out of ten. It has been done before. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. But it is bloody difficult. Because right now, so I have a tour up here where I can't blow them up. That period has now expired. So I'm slowly making my way over to one. So I'm going towards the football pitch below the casino. I'm just happening to hit every sodding red light possible. Oh, I've hit the reverse lights. No one's behind me. Right, cool. So yeah. Um, and yeah, we're going to go from there. So if I don't get those six cars, then we have to do one of the hairier car park escapes. So she have also now been tweaked. So basically, it's now more towards... Like, it favours the hunters now instead of me. Again, this is a tweak that I put in place rather than the hunters and I chatting. The reason being is if I haven't been organised enough or if the hunters have done well enough to keep a chase up for the 24 hours and I haven't been able to get all the cars, then they should be rewarded for it. And that reward is... What is going on here? That's when it comes to car park expect. So, say 24 hours is up. I haven't got six cars. I've only got five. Uh, and yeah, so I've only got five. At 24 hours, they will be no. They will be told of which out of three car parks they have to go. Like that, I'm going to be escaping from. So that is either the multicolored car park, which is over on the west side of the map. Um, I'll point out to you. I'm sure at some point during the hunt. The red car park, which is slap bang in the middle. We've seen it several times in hunts before, so I'm sure we're all familiar with that terminology. And then the last one, which is the car park that's just behind uh, the police station in Strawberry, where your car gets impounded. I'm just going to assume that's still red for me, because I'm, I'm I'm not waiting anymore. Right. So I've only got to go one of those three. So whilst I am here, and I need to concentrate now...
I'm going to do cops on a blind eye. Hey, what's up? Oh, how can I help? And I'm just going to circle the and area first and see if done. I can just spot the orange car before I do anything else. I was going to say, is that Sultan? I haven't seen one of those in ages. Oh, there's a hunter. Oh, there it is. He's parked over that way. Okay. In that case, I think I'm probably clear to get out and walk on foot, I reckon. I reckon that hunter's... He's not long gone, but I reckon I've got enough time to go over here, get a grenade, cock it, drop it. Hopefully watch it blow up. Yep, there it is blown up. Now he's going to be making that call out. I now need to get back to my car, which is over this way. Okay, there's the hunter. I assumed that was a hunter. Maybe not. Hopefully the plea helicopter didn't spot that. There he is there. Okay, we're back back up to numbers, that's fine. So Interceptor's car will be back in place. Okay, so that is Mark's car gone. Now he has two options once the coast is clear and he knows there's no chase being activated because I managed to get away nice and safely. Like I said, he's got two options he can choose with regards to what his next step so because what I'm on about is if I die it doesn't just end there stop there if you've watched one of my hunts you know what I'm on about if you're new around here because I'm all constantly bringing in new viewers then I'll explain to you the concept in a brief way just so you sort of get the idea briefly but also just to make sure that those who are regulars aren't being like oh my god I've heard this like a million times can you just shut up and get on with it already I don't know what that voice was but anyway um don't mean to mock you please don't for much anyway i've got 20 seconds so i'm not going to get to another car in time oh hunter i'm being followed aren't i i think i'm being followed i can't hear the chopper i mean i can't see the chopper but I can hear chopper blades. My driving now has to be spotless. I reckon I'm being I reckon I'm being followed. Yeah. Oh, 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 I don't know actually. Maybe he's not following me. No, he's not. Okay, but he's he's near. I knew I could hear the thud. Right, let's move on swiftly then. And I think I'm going to go for the one that's by Mission Road Police Station. It's tucked away in a nice little garage. But I've got a little sneaky plan of how I'm going to get in and out of that one. Okay, phew! I wasn't being followed. Okay, so the reason why I suspected is because I could hear him, I couldn't see him, and then a hunter came near the area and started slowing down just before the intersection, which made me think... That he was being directed to me. He wasn't being directed to me, thankfully. He must have been being directed to another car. But, okay. Right. So. Like I was saying before I forgot. Um, so, this end game. So, Mark has two options now. He can either take the car he's currently driving and spray it orange. Or, he can either respawn in the Sultan that I've destroyed. And he can now be driving around that Sportan. Sportan? It's because it's a sport. Why don't I... Actually, it's no red light. Why am I staying here? Anyway, he can spawn in. <laughs> it's a spawn tan. Yeah, because I guess it's spawning in a salt tan. Anyway, he can spawn it in and drive around the salt tan. That is the only way that the hunters are allowed sports cars. Otherwise, they aren't allowed sports cars that naturally spawn in game. The reason being for them is, I don't know, it makes it trickier. So the more cars I get, the more of them will be in sportier vehicles. So it adds that sort of risk factor as well. Or duplicates it. So police stations on my left. Could say, 
Oh my god, the brakes are very twitchy on this vehicle. It's a bit risky going to the police station with no cops on a blind eye on. But it's not like the police are going to be right out the front. I'm going to get in. Oh, there's a hunter just in front of me at the intersection. It's the same one we saw earlier. Uh oh. Impromptu. Wonder who's going to be following for that. Fingers crossed it's not me. Stay green. Come on, everyone go. I'm just going to follow the two, the three that have gone to the left. It's like they are, in case I'm being there, I'm not being followed. That's fine. Oh, it's accelerating, isn't it? So, yeah, Mark has two options. Now, the reason being is because if I die, the hunt switches from a survive the hunt essentially to then this new end game phase and what it is in that case is i then get in an armored vehicle a weaponized armored vehicle and i then have to hunt down those orange cars now i asked a while back for some ideas and suggestions of what to title this and just before i get going i'm going to touch on that in a second i just want to get in here get this vehicle done and get out no loitering. It's what I'm doing. I'm loitering. Okay. Oh, to be fair, what a fantastic little spot to hide in. I can hear it next to me. Just going to make sure that's muscle car. Nope. Cool. Let's go for it. Got to commit at this point. Cock it. Drop it. I'm not going to be able to watch it. Actually, we'll be able to watch it blow up. There we go. Blowing up. Over we get. Come on. Over we get. There we go. Through. Into the vehicle that I parked up undercover. One second. One second. Hey. What's going on? Oh, hey. You're in trouble. There we go. Lights okay. are back on. I'll deal with it. Oh, heart in the mouth moment that was. I want to go straight on. No, I don't because that vehicle has just suspected that one. So I'm just going to... Oh, he didn't... Okay, I'm sort of glad that I went right now instead of straight. Because that Hunter's just chilling there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Green, green. Oh, he's got in the car park. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, I'm risking it. I'm risking it for a chocolate biscuit. Oh, look at that fast moving. I mean, if the hunter, if the chopper's about, has he seen? <laughs> he surely must have seen that. No. Oh, okay, that's, that's that's quite that's quite funny. Alright, in that case, I'm going to nip on down to the arena, I think. Head on down south. Because I can gain some good distance on anybody on the highway. And get some good speed going without anyone suspecting it. And I think as well what I'll do, because I think I'm safe, is I'm going to try and... Yeah, so it'll drop down in the wall on that side, so no one's with me. Quick UE, nice little power turn. Fast and Furious would be happy with that. And then... Oh, don't damage the car, don't damage the car. Don't... Not the smoothest landing. But we didn't damage the car. Oh, my personal vehicle's been destroyed. Okay, so now I have to initiate a chase. Oh, I guess best thing to do in that case is we're just going to go to... Let's just go to this one. Oh, do I want to go to this? Yeah, let's just go to the arena. Okay, so... It was found well by one of the hunters. Like, fair plays. So now I have to find the car I want to blow up, which I think is this one. No, it's not. It's this bad boy. So... Cock it, drop it. And watch it blow up. So there we go. Now I do have the police on me, which is going to be an issue. 
but we're going to wait for the hunters just to turn up and then we're going to get going I think also I guess keeping the cops is also a good way of them knowing where I am any hunters going to come in any of them Mark's killed Dozer I guess he's going to call that for the bounty no okay Fine, we'll go find a hunter instead then. Right, where are you at, answers? Where are you? Oh, Intercept's having some bad internet connections tonight. It's fine, I've got his car, that's the main thing, and they knew where his car was. Where is these hunters? Gotta be about somewhere, surely. John's still about, yeah, John's still about. He would have made the call out. Come on, answers. I'm trying to find you to initiate a chase. <laughs> it's so much harder when you're trying to find a sodding hunter. I can't find him. I thought I saw a white car head off this way. Right, let's head off back down to the uh, arena then. It's only fair. It's because that's the thing, the chopper's not even there. We need to meet up for huh. Well, I... Okay. Call out clearly wasn't made for that one. Uh, Alright. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. Uh, what car could I go for next? That's closest. Uh, there's Jack's one in Strawberry. Let's do that one. That one's right around the corner. Let's go do that. Okay, we're off to go do that. It's not too far away. Because apparently none of the hunters came to the car that I went to go blow up. Alrighty. Okay, so apparently should be round here around one of the alleyways not near the clock and bell is it no not near the clock and bell it should just be an orange sultan just literally in the middle well in this intersection i don't know if it's per gonna be hmm. no. you tucked your way behind here somewhere Jackie boy. Is that a garage I can open? No. No. I'm going to spend my life searching for this vehicle, aren't I? No. Def so I've got the notification of the person with it, so I don't have to worry about that. Okay, well, I can't find this, this vehicle of Jack's, which is a bit frustrating. Which also defeats the point of... Uh... It's definitely at this intersection. This is further up. Maybe it's further up. I'm going to... I want to find it. I want to find this vehicle. Okay, I'm not gonna, am I? I love the way during the entirety of this, I've been going a little bit balls to the wall, heavy metal surviving, desperate to find a bloody car, and I haven't been spotted at all. Yeah, I'll do something very cheeky, and I'll get spotted straight away. I have no idea where this car is, so I'm just gonna have to call time. Thing is, I, I, I guess you know what? We'll chill now. We'll find the next car to go for. And if I then see a hunter, I'll crash into him and go from there. Because I'm not wasting my time going around the map trying to find the Sonic Hunter. But anyway, so we can't find Jax. But we have, if we do a little tally. So we have got the arena of John's tick. We have got the Fibble Pitch one. Tick. Oh, I hear sirens. It's got to be... Is that behind me? No. Where is it? Where is it?
Okay, disappeared. So, not sure who that was. Oh my god. Okay, I started going because I was called. Okay, alright. So, we got that one, and then we got Interceptors, which is in the parking garage next to the the garage. So, we've done that one. I actually need to go up. I've also been messaged by Lauren who's doing the map that I've blown. They're like, you blow they've blown your car up. And I'm like, I don't know where they <laughs> I don't know where they are. It's all good and well saying I've blown the car up, but I went on a bloody five minute rampage trying to look for them and I couldn't find them. I'm just messaging. Oh, they're waiting for me near where my car was, apparently. Fine. Fine, let's do this then. Let's get straight to them. I didn't realise they're going to be waiting by where my car was. That wasn't bloody... Okay, I clearly didn't explain that rule well enough. Okay, here we go. <sighs> well, I mean, they're going to be bloody ten hunters now. Surely that has told them. No? I did a spectacular little cinematic jump as well. I mean, this is just getting silly now. If they can't find me, I'll just find them then. Okay, right. I'm I'm moving on. If they can't spot me, whatever. I will just heavy metal survive it to another. There. Okay, fine. I see. I see one. I see one. I will then go and just chase that down. I think there's a whole bloody line going. Right. I see dragon. He's in some big trucks. So let me go nudge into him because that's the classification of. Right, there we go. I've now splattered someone across my screen. Okay, let's get going now. Finally. Oh my god. Oh, I'm being... Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, well this... Oh my god. Okay, there we go. Finally got away. That thing is speedy, I know that for sure. But because I thought it was bulky and it's going to be hard to turn, I'd allow it. Right, initiated a chase. Let's get this go going, gone, <laughs> done, whatever. Ay, ay, ay. Bit hairy. I thought at one point I might be toast. Thankfully I wasn't. Oh my god. <laughs> no, wait for him to <laughs> Okay, whilst that hunter's gone off that way, we'll go off down this way. Front the needle! Lovely. Just keep going. Oh, there's another one. Oh my god. Control, control. Handle. Okay, so I do have the chopper on me. Which is the worst one of them all to have on me. I can hear there's another one behind me. Oh my god. No, no, no. Okay. Thank you for nudging me into the wall. Appreciate it. Okay. So I should have straight line speed, I reckon on this lot so oh well this is where it gets interesting now because I've not done this rule before and I've just slowed down for no apparent reason use the barrier to my advantage bounce off it
go down and up because why not make it interesting okay so it's been a long time since I've been in a in an epic chase and I've managed to shift off the helicopter so let's use that to my advantage oh wow was that just I don't know what's going on there oh no there he is there he is there he is there he is don't get spotted don't get spotted don't get spotted don't get spotted on a super come on give me a blue hammer give me a blue hammer no no oh! screw this Holy okay <sighs> I think that's a hunter potentially on the left no it's not okay that was very manic what's the time Okay, so we've just had over 12 hours. Actually, we haven't even had 12 hours. It's 11.30. This would be 12 hours. Okay, good. Green lights keeps me going. Gets me away from this hairy situation. And I think probably the best situation for me now is... I think I'm going to head towards one of those spots on the... West side, northwest side. So that is going to be the uh, church area, the graveyard... Or we have... What's the other one? So the reason why, at this interjection, in this junction here, that I turn left, even though the obvious way would have been to go right, is I span out, because I can't remember if I hit a car or street furniture or, or a tree, I can't remember what it was, it all happened in a flash, in a blur, is I heard an engine of a, of a sporty car right next to me. So I was like, yeah, no, 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 I've got to go. So I turn around. That was risky, doubling back on myself, because I had <laughs> three or four of them trying to dive bomb and block me off. But the chopper's still over there, so he's... They're distracted. I've, I've managed to lose them. Thank God. I mean, I don't know how long I spent going, Toot toot, I'm over here, waving my bloody flags, and... You know, maybe I should have set... Maybe I should have set off a flare. Maybe that's the way to go in the future. Oh. <laughs> Interceptor's just chilling. Okay, that was a bullet dodged. Wowza. <laughs> Interceptor's possibly nearly spotted me twice and he hasn't even realised it, unless he's playing it unbelievably cool as a cucumber. Okay, so I don't have the speed on them with this Hummer. Which I think is what helped me out massively. Oh, they're over there. I don't know if they maybe saw I got out. Maybe they thought I got out on foot or something. I don't know. Okay. We're good to go. <sighs> okay. Wow. That's exciting. So, I mean, half the time, half the cars done and dusted. So whether or not John made the call out or they thought I was literally going to go straight to them, give myself on a plate, you know, like a pig with an apple in its mouth, going, I'm here, come and get me, situation. I should have maybe explained that better. Um, but, oh well, it doesn't matter. They found me, nudged into Dragon and that beastly looking thing. I can't remember what it's called. Nearly cocked up because I wasn't able to get away straight away. That thing blocked me off and then I couldn't get any momentum to get going. It just kept wheel spinning. And then there was another hunter literally right there on the site, ready. I think that must have been Mart. Uh, because Incept has been in and out. Oh, we saw Incept actually. Yeah, it must have been Mart. So, so they're all opting for those Sultans. So, which it means that if I was to then die, it would switch. I would then have to hunt down those three Sultans. So that would be Interceptor, which we just saw a second ago, Mart, and John playing since Pong. Uh, it's got a good little... Um, rhythm to it anyway so and then the end game would then i'd have to hunt them down now i've had i asked for you know, a couple of hunts ago um it's going to be a long time since you've heard me give the feedback for suggestions and i've written down the suggestions some of you touched upon what each other said but there was two main ones that were just fantastic and i've had to write them down to give them a little bit of a shout out because 
you know, I always ask for comments and I never expect comments. It's not like I'm like, right, I know I'm going to get, you know, 50 or comments or whatever and, you know, good stuff to read. I, you know, whenever I say, please leave a comment, you know, I love reading what you guys say. I really do mean it. I mean, I've not been spectacular with replying to every single video. I know that. But I appreciate it. Anyway, besides the point. So, the first one I got was from Edward Rhodes. Thank you very much. He put down as Redeem the Hunt or the Orange Cart in-game. Now, those two I do like very much, Redeem the Hunt, because it's been switching, and I'm redeeming myself from dying. I love it. I think it's a brilliant idea. I'm going to be probably interchanging between all of these, because they're fantastic. Now, apparently, there's a car next to Ron's garage. Oh, it's going to be tucked away around the back, isn't it? I reckon we go for that. Right, one second, just whilst I'm distracted. I can hear the chopper as well, but I'm just going to... just going to ignore it, leave it be. And the other suggestion was from Becky. Thank you very much for the comment as well, Becky. Which is ghost busting. Now this one is a person. Like I think this one is top tier suggestion. Now if you're not sure, if you if you haven't connected the dots yet, basically they have had the sultans blown up. So the and they're now driving around. So they're driving ghosts. And then my end game is then to blow up those ghosts. Ergo, ghost busting. I think it's brilliant. I think it's fantastic. And if some of you got it straight away and I've explained it to you, I'm sorry, but it's for those who weren't quite sure, hadn't connected the dots yet, I think it's a fantastic idea. But like I said, I'm going to be interchanging between all of them because they're fantastic. I've had such a tricky time trying to, you know, explain how the end game works and everything. So these ones are definitely going to help me out. So thank you very much for the suggestions. And thank you to anyone who put suggestions. Even though I may not have made a call out to you right now, I do appreciate it. There's definitely something funky going on around here, isn't there? Come on. Hey, let's blow up a Greyhound track next week. Okay, just had a car near me. So it's a little bit of a... It's a bit of a hairy situation. Now, one of the hunters joked about this rooftop. Could have sworn I heard one. But they know me. I'm not afraid to follow through and do what they dare. Uh, just the question is, can I get a good angle? blow this car up. Ooh. There's multiple. Obviously one's an AI, I'm not sure which one's an AI or which one's... Anyway. Cock it, and drop it, and watch it blow up. There we go. Right. So. Okay. There we. <laughs> hey, which one of my skills is required? Okay, okay, I'll oh, get you out of trouble. Get the angle, no get the angle, problem. get the angle. Ah, oh, he's probably seen me, hasn't he? Go, go, catch him, catch him, catch him, Derek! Catch him! No, Derek! Okay. 
So they know now I'm on foot because they've heard that massive explosion. Catch him! Catch him, Derek! No! <laughs> they know I'm going for it. I don't I just don't think he knows where I am. I just have to make sure that no one Come here, you! I know I'm spotted. <laughs> Go on! Catch him! Okay, I'm, I'm intrigued to know if he tries to jump down at any point. I don't think you come too close, Sunny Jim. There we go. Back off. Just trying to make sure the nano can come up the ladder as well. Catch him, Derek. No. Come on. Oh, that's going to be tricky. No, no. Oh! Oh, okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. That's worked out beautifully for me. I accidentally killed Limsusil, who's a late addition to this hunt. handling because I was obviously oh my god oh my god why hello how you doing yeah Call okay a minute and a half about them okay that is interceptor so I need to be wary of him okay send him to the shops I'll have a couple of biscuits with that one, please, dragon. <laughs> oh, did he try and decant? I'm guessing he tried to decant. Okay, perfect time now. Oh, my God. To lose the cops, unfortunately. God, this thing is slow, man. Oh, hello. Never gotten out of that badly. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. Surely a minute has passed since then. Surely I could do with just chilling out, letting my heart rate. I'm guessing you don't want a back rub. How can I help? Oh, God damn it, Mart! Okay, yeah, we'll get rid of you. I'm not in the fastest vehicle in the world, but oh, hey. that's the fine with me. Mm, okay. Okay. I'll deal with it.
Oh, my heart is absolutely racing, can I just say. I'm focusing so much on this getaway. This vehicle's not done me too badly, but because they have sports cars, it makes it so much trickier pace-wise. I don't have that automatic pace advantage of jumping in a sports car anymore. Oh boy, I should be commentating, I know, but this is high in the mouth stuff instead. I think if I didn't have armor, I'd have probably died. I don't know who was shooting at me at the top there. But there you go. I was so distracted by the helicopter. Oh, boy. I don't want to go for a Yugo, though. That's the thing. Right, what time are we looking at? Oh, I've got four, I need to get two. This might entail some heavy metal surviving, you know. Right, plan of action. I'm gonna steal the Obey 9F because that is a sports car. I'm entitled to those. Which one and we are then going required? to Heavy Metal Survive It. And I think we're gonna do. We've done Morning Woods. Uh, we could go Lifeguard Tower. We've done Arena. Uh, I'm just trying to think what, I'm, what I could do. Uh, I don't know where that one is. The FIB building. Okay, we're gonna do FIB building. And we'll go to the okay, Police Station because it's be literally around the corner. And then race over to FIB building. Heavy metal surviving. We've got less than two hours to get this job done. Right, this is going to be hairy, but we can do this. Let's just get it done. Quickly as possible. Prom to race. God, this thing backfires, doesn't it? Inceptor died. Maybe it's the perfect time to go in. In case that was 100, just want to go nice and slow. God, Obey 9F, you need to calm down with this backfiring, mate. Okay, I'm going to have a different strategy around this car as well. We're going to go up here. It's not going to reach you, Pillock. Oh, if that plan relied on the fact that it was going to be literally right there and it wasn't. So that's my own fault. And I have activated Cops on a Blind Eye too soon. So this is a case of get in, blow it up, get out and move on. Yeah, because I don't have long left. Ah, it's right there. He did it undercover. Right. There we go. Gone. Right, one to go. One to go, people. We're on five. Heavy metal surviving, activated. We've got an hour, two minutes. 
literally just need to get one car, otherwise it's going to be one of the hairiest escapes with the escape. Alright, I'm just having to message Lauren because apparently they didn't get the notification, so I told them to tell them. Right, okay, right, okay, scoochie free, scoochie free, scoochie free, right, 30 seconds now. Don't crash, come on, before it gets to 9.30, so I've got less than two minutes now. Hang on, I'm a bit confused what's going on because... Oh, hang on. Yeah, no, the, the hunt has an ended. There we go. I don't know why I'm being I'm being messaged a car park and obviously it's not been up. It's not happened. Oh, <laughs> come on now, dragon, come on. Sending the wrong way. Thing I'm gonna do. <laughs> right, well, I sent Dragon to the uh, shops earlier for some cup, uh, some biscuits. I'd like some tea bags, lads. I need a cup of tea to go over now. <laughs> I'm having fun with them now. There we go, 9:30. The hunt is up. I have survived the hunt. Ooh, nearly got dive bomb by the. Uh... Oh, 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 oh. There we go, coming in. <laughs> How did I kill him? That makes no sense. This is a... Okay, you know what? This is going on for a while. Whilst we're still here, let's keep it going. Where are you? Oh, I thought a few more would for me. They haven't. Right, okay, cool. Well, like I said, the time is up. I've managed to survive the hunt. Let's see if we can just get him. Let's see if we can get him. Let's see if we can get him. Let's see if we can get him. Come on, land it. No, it hasn't landed. <laughs> oh, well. Well, I think that has potentially been one of the luckiest hunts ever. By accidentally falling off the building and not dying because I thought they'd have killed me. It gave me a lucky escape. Dragon then fling me in the air, which then also gave me a nice escape. It, uh, I, I honestly doesn't feel like I deserve to survive that one, but wow! Six cars on the skin of my teeth. So, we ramp it up. Next hunt, I've got to get seven. It's going to get hairy, but we're most likely looking at a car park escape. But we'll have to see. Maybe I might get a, bit, a little bit more lucky with the next one. But we'll see how it goes. Right, well that is all for this one. I'm running down, hoping to join in with the action. So, if you have enjoyed this hunt, then do please leave a like. I'm probably about to get into a massive gunfight, so... There we go, there's Liam. There's Liam. Anybody else want some? Who wants some? There's Dragon. Anybody else? No, I mean, I'm getting in on the action, but okay. That's it. Well, like I said, please leave a like if you have enjoyed the video. If you have also enjoyed what you've watched and you haven't subscribed already, then do please hit that subscribe button. I massively appreciate it. And yeah, comment down below with anything you have got to say. And in normal Survive the Hunt standard, with the end of it, because it's being so manic, I'm going to probably wait for one of these cops to kill me. And then that's going to be the end of that. So here we go. Like, comment, subscribe. JDB Gaming. Out of Monday. I want to play a game.